see. Yeah. Good. Control S to save it. Control 1. Get rid of the words. Now let's <clears throat> now let's look at the backdrop again. Hmm. All right. I will cheat a little bit here. Select all these edges. Go to the side view. Get a linear fall off. Wrong way around. So reverse. And then I hit the W key and bring this down to about here. Drop the tool. Get rid of the fall off. Let's have a look how this looks. It's good. Now I select these edges. and hit the set key not too many edges for the time being then I put an edge in here And put two in here, Alt C. Now let's see. I think we need another one here as well. Yeah. And how does it look when we bring in the bottom as well? from the top view. W key and move it a bit to here. Perspective. So, next, I think I will mirror this. No, can't. Select all these edges. W key. Control set. Shift select this edge. W key. And move this about to here. Now we can select all these edges. Hit the R key and flatten them out. OK. Now I can mirror this over the set.
top view duplicate mirror over the set apply let's have a look then how the bottom yeah it's coming it is coming but we have still some problems so let me get rid of this part here delete <coughs> and I think I put these edges in a bit too early so let's get rid of them as well backspace key because when we look at the backdrop we can see that this area is not straight it is flat uh, it is uh, angled so I need to put in an angle here let's see edge at loop maybe here then I select these edges up arrow key <coughs> to the middle here go to top view and hit the R key with action center origin and bring this in a bit like so perspective let's see yes next I will select all these edges, hit the B key and bevel this in with a round level of mm, yes, three sounds good. Let's see. next problem we have is in here so side view shift c and i cut through here to hold this edge here a bit better looks nice perspective now what else i think it's time to thicken this one and then to bring them together no there is yet another problem this is way too far in so and we don't get everything w key and bring it to about here drop the tool perspective I think I save control s before I continue so let's try to thicken this hit <coughs> go to polygon thicken click in the viewport use the blue handle and push it in a bit like so let's see if we got everything yeah okay now I select this top view then go to duplicate mirror over the set apply 
perspective. Drop the two. So now we must merge these two halves together. Um, I select these edges here. Come on. Sorry, polys rather. Mm. No plausible next element found. I think we have a problem. Let me go to vertex, merge, automatic. Yeah. And then, just to be on the safe side, go to polygon, reduce, unify, force unify, OK. Mm -hmm. Now, that looks better. Okay, let's try again. This one, this one, upper arrow key, much better. No, that's good. Now, select this one. This one, like so, and then we can right click here and bridge them together. 